Hey guys, and welcome back to Resident Evil 2, where we last left off, we were exploring the B scenario as our friend Leon here. Now, I do want to explore as much of this as possible before Mr. X turns up. I can't really remember what trigger points he has for Leon. There is bullets down here, I believe. So we do want to loot as much of this as possible. So we've got all that. I can't get into the records room because we need the club key. We can open up the west office now. And the great thing about opening up the west office is, at least I think, yes, the heart key. We don't. We can't use that. Uh, the great thing about opening up the west office. Is we now <clears throat> never need to go this way again. So that is exactly why we won't be boarding up that area. So actually to that end what we could do is go over there. We've got two more boards. Oh shit, did I not? Oh, that was stupid of me. <clears throat> yeah, this ain't going to be a speedrun or anything like that, obviously. Because generally that's not how I enjoy to play games. I enjoy going slow and uh, just, you know, all that stuff. And with speedruns as well, you have to take a very defined path through the game and all this stuff. Uh, I have like optimized my time as much as I possibly could to unlock things. But apart from that, there's one more window there. Do we actually have a board for that? Uh, we don't. Well, that's fine. We can let... Wasn't there a... A diary or something in here? I mean, it wasn't the original, but... Never mind. And we can't go down there yet, I don't think. There is stuffs down here, though. Apparently. No, I didn't think so. We can't come down here just yet. Which is absolutely fine by me. Because we've already got enough areas to start looking at and uh, exploring. Oh, there's two more windows there yet. Okay, so we've boarded up three of them. Excuse me, fellas, coming through. Alright, who's making all that bloody noise through there? Of course, there is the other window there, but it's already smashed. You only get, like, one zombie come through each time, so we can actually go do the library now. We can set the library up because we've got the key. But we can also go this way as well. I mean, if we've got to go past the star's office, we might as well go do this. Let's grab that. Let's use you. So weird, the sound for the keys and whatnot actually comes out of the... Oh, shit. I did not know you was through here, Sunshine. Oh, hey, pal. Let me guess. Yep, there's more through there as well. Alright, let's deal with these guys. Oh, boy. Come on. Uh-oh. No, I don't want to do that. Okay. That was bad. That was really bad. That was really poor on my part, that was. Don't know what that guy's legs are made out of. Holy shit. There's no point using that yet. Come on. 
Come on. Okay, that's fine. Right, can you die, please, so I can have my knife back? I really would like my knife back, if it's all the same. Alright, let's kill you. Yeah. That was really not good. Uh-oh. Is the other guy... Yeah, the other guy's still kicking. Uh, you know what? Settle down with some more bullets, mate. There we go. Um... Okay, there's another green there. Let's just have one. Shouldn't really have used that because it is a huge waste, but it's fine. Right. Now, veterans of the original will know what's going to happen here. That's nice. Oh, we don't have the book yet. Need to go through to the library first. Okay, that's fine. So let's go do the library bit. Okay. Cool. So there's still something. Ah, there's bullets there as well. Only three. Right, okay. Well, let's go to the library. We don't have a lot of bullets left. We've got 10 rounds. But I suppose we could go and get the shotgun. Which I actually think would be a wise decision right now. Let's go get the shotgun. Because once we've got the shotgun, we can start popping heads. And we need to pop heads. And the shotgun, at least I think, is way better than Claire's Grenade Launcher. I don't know why. Like, Claire's Grenade Launcher is a lot of fun to use. But this shotgun, though. This shotgun. So, 109 we can do. And we can do 106. So, 109. One oh six. I suppose we could actually use the bullets to be fair. I'm gonna take that just for shits and giggles. And give this eight spare, which isn't anything to write home about, but it's better than nothing. Uh where were those bullets? We've got a health item in there which is fine. Oh, there was the wooden board there, but fuck that. Who cares? So, basically, we need to make our way to the library. But we do need an item room. Ah, oh, it's such a pain getting used to the fact that there is no item... ...box in the main hall. They really spoiled us in the original. Uh, in the first scenario with that. We've got a board. Let's go. You know what? Just use that. It's fine. It's not as if there isn't enough health in this game. There is plenty of health. Okay, so off to the library we go. Some reason the door was opening then. I was like, what is this? Why are you no open? Let's go grab this herb. Just in case. Why did they remove that? That's so damn annoying. We've got that one.
I'm going to the wrong area. Because of course I am. That's what I do. I always go to the wrong bloody areas. Even though I've like played this. I'll tell you what it is. It's the uh, Let's Players Curse. Like when I'm not recording this. I'm so focused. I know exactly where I'm going. I know exactly what I'm doing. But as soon as I start recording. Brain gets muddled. Really is quite hard to... Think. Ooh, put that bad boy away. Let's use up the crap first, Leon. Oh, hello, love. I say. Use the knife. You didn't use the knife. Why did you not use the knife? Okay. Point in case. Alright, well, she's done. Alright, let's sort him out. Anyone would think I've never played this game before. Couldn't blame anyone for thinking that either. Oh, of course, playing as Leon as well. We get to play as uh, Ada a little bit later on. And I really don't like Ada's section. It's really boring. I like Ada. Ada's a cool character. But her section in this is, is not fun. I'm doing this way. We don't have to worry about zombies later on. Come on. There we go. You're dead. And you're also dead. Now we can also preempt this as well. Because we're going to have Mr. X chasing us later. So let's get this set up. So now all we've got to do is put that in. Because you can shove all of these in one push. Which I didn't realise. Um, yeah, there is a combat knife on the floor. And there is bullets down here as well, thinking about it. Also, we have the key. Oh! Maybe not. Okay. We don't have the book that we need for the scepter. That's interesting. What's in here? Oh, we've already got the book for the feckin' scepter. That's why. Idiot. What's in here? Lion statue. Hmm. Interesting. Well, we, we already have, like, everything we need. So that's the unicorn. And the unicorn is twins uh, scale and worm. I wouldn't have said... Why did I write that down? What's that? Okay. Right, now before... Let's go get... Let's go around the other side. And get the lockbox open up. Because we've got to go to the star's office now, so we might as well tap that place out. As much as we can, anyway. And Leon is pretty damn injured right now. And then we can go fight William. Now these guys should still be dead. Yeah, they are. Pretty much. Right, okay, cool. Give me the scepter. Now, in my first run, I can't believe how much of an idiot I was over the scepter. I mean, I knew we needed it for something, but I never quite twigged what we needed it for. And it's kind of flipping obvious when you think about it. And hear that smash. Hmm. 
Yep. Mr. Licker decides to make a dramatic drop through the door, which I at well, through the roof, which I actually really like because that happened in the original. So we need to go back to an item box now. Oh, man. Item boxes are so far away. Item boxes are bloody miles away in this remake. But we do need them. But then I suppose if we're going back to this item box room, we can board up the last two doors. Yeah, because we've got one on us and we've got one there. Why do I keep saying doors? They're windows. Windows and doors are not the same thing. At least, I don't think they're the same thing. There we go. Right, let's go. This place is such a mess. Holy shit. Uh, we can go that way as well, actually. Thinking about it, that is like a slightly quicker way of getting around. And this way we do get to use up these items. Because we're going to be using this passageway quite a lot, I think. Oh, okay, we can't board that one up. Fair enough. Uh, <clears throat> right, so drop that down for now. Drop that down for now. Drop that down for now. Let's... Grab you. And open says me. Stars badge. Very nice. And if we're going up to the stars office, which we are, we're going to want to do that. Alright, let's go. Uh, is it actually any quicker to go around that way? No, not really. If anything, it's probably like ever so slightly longer to go that way. I do like the ambient like zombie sounds as well. It always keeps you on edge. Like, is that an ambient sound or is that actually a zombie about to fucking chew my head off? Rip my face off and wipe his ass with it. I like the way they actually mentioned that this uh, police precinct used to be a museum as well. Which explains the decor. Very cool. Oh, I thought that was locked. Thinking about it. So we do have to go up and around. Well, that's a pain. Okay, you can definitely tell that I haven't really played B scenario. I only played it once. Many, many, many moons ago. So we have to go upstairs through the west storage and down. Uh, which does mean we have to go back through the item box room. Man, that's a pain in the balls, honestly. I've wasted your time and mine, ladies and gentlemen. Never mind. This is absolutely fine. So whilst we're here, we don't really need to drop anything off. Nope. But we do want to be on our toes. Ah, there is... Oh no, there's bullets there that I forgot. Only three, but you know. Three bullets is three bullets. Can mean the difference between a nice... Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, because we can get to the star's office through this way. And unlock it through that. Yeah, okay. Let's do that.
I don't know why I thought I was going up and through there. That's just silly. Hey, buddy. Now, I don't know if this guy's... Yeah, this guy's fine. So, not sure if he's actually going to come to life. In the B scenario, I can't remember. I couldn't remember. Take the handgun. Powder. Right, I'm not going to fight a liquor. Even with the shotgun. Because it's straight up not worth it. don't actually know if there is a liquor on this uh, playthrough in here. But we can open up the armory, which is exactly what we are going to do. And we're going to get us the Magnum. Nice. So, Claire Memo. Oh yeah, Leon, hope... Yeah, this is one of the different ones. I hope you find this. The station's done. Get out of here ASAP. Don't worry about me. I'll be alright. And don't stress about my brother either. Just focus on getting yourself out of here alive. Uh, yes, boss? Yeah, the Lightning Hawk, which is basically the Desert Eagle, essentially. Let Stars members. Yeah, that's exactly the same. So, got some more shotgun shells. One shotgun shell. They really are stingy in this game. With the shotgun ammo. Like, proper freaking stingy. You know what, we'll mix that up there. Okay, anything else in here? There is a herb. A red herb. Which is actually quite nice. We'll have the red herb. Ah, yeah, of course. And we need our emblem back. Um. And the battery. Which we can put in there. Lovely. Yep, that's just explaining that. Okay. So this is oh shit. Okay, I did <laughs> I did not know he was there. Oh bollocks. Um, that's a little bit awkward. Uh, right. Let's go to. Oh shit, we need to get up there. But let's go to the save room. Jiggle our bits and pieces around. Alright, Mr. X. Holy shit. I was not expecting him there. Okay. Alright, store that. Store that. I've got like loads of F8 sprays now. Uh, we might use that in a minute. Let's hold on to... We... Right, let's... Put that back. Put that back. Put that back. We're just about to use the detonator. Oh shit, we've got to use the detonator now with X chasing us. Hmm. This is going to be a little bit interesting. Well, alright. Do we have more shotgun shells? We do. We've got like 11 there. We don't need that many on us. Mm, let's be on like... You know what? I don't know if... I might take an F8 spray. Just in case. Yeah. 
He is above us as well. Which is annoying. Come on, you bastard. Or is he? Yeah, he is above us. We need to get him down here. Oh no, he's... Okay, I think he's jogged on. Which is nice. Okay, he's... He's up here somewhere. But I don't know if he's up... I don't know if he's up here. Or if he's below us. Which is problematic. I'd rather he's not below us, to be honest. There's a memo here. Yeah. Oh, he's in here. That's bloody wonderful. Alright. Well, let's use this to spin him out. Ah, shit. Dude, you're not making this easy, man. I just want to, like, go up there and use the bomb and blow stuff up so I can get the fuck out of here. Like, seriously. And now you're coming back this way, aren't you? Yes, you are. Because you are a massive fucking dickhead. Yes, right. You heard me. I said you are a massive fucking dickhead. There's nothing there. Uh, there's gunpowder over here, which I do want. Oh, hey, pal. Run, Leon. 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 No, this is bad. Oh, bollocks. Dude, Leon, move. Why are you not mo moving? Yeah, we definitely need that. Uh, give me a second, X old boy. I just need to, you know, sort this out. And this was... Ram... One second, X. I'll be right with you. Ram. Harp. And bird. Yeah. One second, buddy. Yep. Alright. Uh, run. Run. Okay. Not sure why we got keep getting stuck on the scenery. Which is really bloody annoying. Yeah, guy scribblings. We don't care about guy scribblings. Oh, no. No, no. Bad, bad, bad. Give me my knife back, please. Damn it. No, X. You're such an absolute cunt. Okay. Fuck you, X. There we go. We're done. <sighs> I feel like I have been done. Yep, X is a cock buffer. Wow, what a time for him to show up as well. He's literally breathing down my neck. I can feel his hot breath on my neck. As we speak. Right. At least he's kind enough to wait for us to, you know. Um, yeah. Get these emblems. Now, this should be a save room. He shouldn't actually follow us in here. I say he shouldn't. I can't remember, to be honest. But, man, I can't believe he turns up there. That's hellish. Run, Leon. 
or at least hobble slowly. Hey, birdie, you coming down here? No, no, you're not. Fuck off. Oh, shit. That was not great. We took so much damage from him there. Man, that was not good. Dude. He does not play around, does he, in this difficulty? Right, let's grab the Matilda. And let's take the magazine and the brake. Oh, we're almost dead as well. Yeah, we can use that against William. Because I don't... I don't really... We're using another F8 spray. I don't really want to... Don't not going to use those again. We're going to take that with us. We got the infinite knife. We don't need handgun ammo. I have a feeling, guys, that we're going to be riding this one on the seat of our pants. We're just about to use that up. I don't know why I bother organizing my inventory either, to be honest. Yeah, I prefer it like that. Um, right, yeah, so we're just about to use the dongle up. We could take some more shotgun cartridges, but I don't know if there's any point in that. We could take some flash grenades, but again, like, William is so easy. Mm -hmm. Now you watch. I've said it. You watch me get my ass stomped by him. Oh, God. Right, anyway, guys, I'm going to leave it there. So when we come back... We're going to go fight William. I think this is the only time you fight William as Leon. I think. I might be wrong about that. I'm probably wrong about that. But anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. And as always, till next time.